pass and welcome back and this video we are going to learn how to revoke access from mysql user so in the last video we learned how to grant access if you don't know how to grant access to a user you can watch my uh, previous video so in this video we will learn how to revoke access well sometimes we have multiple users in mysql and we don't want to or a specific user to do you know do everything we don't want to allow our specific user to perform all tasks like uh, creating database creating database we just want to uh, just run some uh, you know some uh, some general queries like a select uh, or so like uh, reading of reasons and we don't want to this user to write uh, to a mysql database and you know it's like uh, something so this is all about achieving security so let's see how to revoke access from a particular user so let's just so let's so let's try to connect to the mysql server it's time mysql now let's first check all the privileges given to user god so grants for god at the red local host and then enter now god uh, the username God has all the privileges. It means it can create new database, it can delete database, it can create new table. But we don't want to allow this user doing these high, you know, such such commands. So we need to revoke access from this user. So let's try to revoke the access from this user. Before we revoke access from this user, let's try to log in as a code and let's see what uh, it uh, has, you know. So exit and then log in as code. Okay, and let's have a look on database list. So it has access to all these databases now we are going to remove the access to these all databases so in order to do that we need to revoke the access from these databases now exit from here and login as a administrator again all right and then type revoke all privileges on first start for the databases and the second style is for tables and then enter all right now let's check the privileges for this user all right so we have successfully done that so let's go back to the user code again just type x and then and then enter now we are logged in as a user god and let's have a look on database list again all right so we have successfully revoked permission for this user to access these all database that were created by administrator so thank you for watching this video i think this uh, uh this is half of you some for some sometimes if you want to revoke access from the user and uh, thank you guys in the next video we will learn how to change the password 